Welcome back to Wayne's World of Gaming where we play, talk about and collect everything PlayStation. Now, today I want to touch on a topic. Are discs only keys to download digital content? Now, a few people have brought this up on videos recently and I just want to try and see if I can do an experiment to try and address this. So obviously a lot of like PS4 games and stuff, they're all going to be on the disc. But people have been talking about that the, the newer games at least... There's no point buying discs anymore because you you they're just a, a like a license key to purchase the digital version. So I thought I'm gonna do a little experiment and see if we do need a data connection or whatever to install a disc. So these are the two newest releases I've got: Silent Hill and Halloween. Well, Retro Realms Halloween, Ash vs Evil Dead. These are the newest releases I have. Um, this is only a couple of weeks old. This is about a month old now. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to completely disconnect the internet from my PlayStation. It will have no internet connection at all. And we're going to try to install these games and see if they'll play. If they do, to me, that means that you are not getting a digital version. Because you don't have any way of connecting to the internet to get the digital version. And all the data is actually on the disc. So, hopefully, it, it may not put the argument to bed. And there may be some games that do have a digital key or it is a digital key the disc rather but it may i don't know clear up a few things and not all games are created equal maybe some are on the disc some aren't so i'm just hoping him to answer that question because i've seen a few people talking about it so let's just do the experiment and see what happens shall we excuse the dog what are you doing buddy Right, so this is my router. I'm going to unplug it now and we will have no internet in the house at all. Oh, shit. There we go, no more lights. Right, so I have just stuck Silent Hill 2 into the PlayStation and let's see what happens. They're showing a disc up there. I just want to show you network. Right, so Silent Hill 2 has popped up and it's starting to copy. And there we go, it's failed now because I, I you always have a wired connection. I've got an Ethernet cable, no internet connection. So, there we are. So we are currently on 9%. I will let you know how if, if anything pops up and obviously if it just installs and we can play it. So. Let's keep an eye on it. So we've just finished installing and we should be able to play the game looking at this. Um, I just want to show you as well that I'm still not connected to the internet. Hard to do this one handed. Network failed. Right, so I've just fired it up and it looks to be working so far. Very noisy, but. <clears throat> oh, have I lost all my data? Because basically I deleted my thing. Because I, I already have the game installed, so I deleted it. Would that have deleted all my save data? I really hope not. It is actually playing. So that's answered Silent Hill. Let's try Retro Realms. Right, so let's get this second game in. 
and then see if this one will install as well. This one is absolutely flying up. Jeez. And let's, I just want to prove that I'm still not connected to the network. So there we go. So let's give it a go, shall we? Hard to do this one handed. And there's old Michael over there, look. Here we go, look, we are actually playing. And there we are, folks, it is actually playing. So let's see if I can kill someone one-handed, shall we? Oh. No, I can't because I need to jump. I can't jump and turn at the same time. So, anyway, it's working. So there you go. Both of the games copied off the disc. They both played without any internet connection. So to me, that proves that they do, they're do. they not keys to the digital download. Um, so everyone keeps saying, oh, don't buy physical anymore. The digital. Like I said, I can't, ex I can't account for every single game ever created. But both of those games are less than a month old. They're new releases. So if any games are going to be like that, it's going to be the newer ones. Like I said, they're about a month old. So, well, Silent Hill's about a month old. Retro Realms is later again. So to me, that kind of proves that they're not digital keys. So let me know what you think in the comments. Has that kind of proved it? Because there's no internet connection in my house and I will still manage to get the data off the disc and play both games. So if anyone keeps saying that, oh, you don't buy discs anymore, they're only digital keys, you just as well go digital, they're talking out their ass. So you hear it here first, your boy's done the test. Hopefully that'll prove to all these assholes on the internet that discs are still worth buying. They are not digital keys. And I just want to say, with the Silent Hill, I don't think I've lost all of my progress. What has happened is the save data. Now that is where you may struggle. The save data saved to the cloud, the PlayStation Cloud. So obviously I deleted all the data off my, my PlayStation. Um, it, it, there's no record of me owning that game or playing that game anymore. I reinstalled the disc. There's no record at all. So it does mean you wouldn't have any save data but if it's a brand new game or a game you haven't played before that wouldn't matter but i'm lucky now i can connect to the internet again and get my save data back so there we are but to me that just proves a point that discs are still worth buying so everyone who says otherwise they're talking nonsense i'm gonna leave it there anyway folks just a quick video i just wanted to get this experiment done because it's been in the back of my mind that, like i like collecting discs a lot, and then I've made a couple of videos about dig, discs versus digital and people are saying, well, everyone's going digital. There's no point buying discs anymore because all they are is digital keys. And I wanted to figure out a way how to prove whether they were or not. And this is the closest I could get. So fingers crossed, like I said, those two games aren't just digital keys. So fingers crossed, every other game's the same. So I'll leave it on that bombshell. I'll catch you all on the next video. And as always, take care of yourselves. Stay safe. And game on. Big respect to the gamer. Name of Wayne in his world PlayStation. Wayne's the same and he's got love for the levels. High score or not. But for now, he'll show you why his collection's hot. Wayne's world! Game